INEC chairman wakes up his conscience, heads to court to confess who actually won the election. Exposed to go. Make him no make make him no confess. It should remain that way. Eh? You don't understand. See, the little that has been done to him and the, the little threats that he has received, I tell you, it's not enough. It's not enough. Um, you see, it's very disappointing that a man of his status and caliber will give room for such a nonsense to be, to, to be um, considered or to be to be played despite all of the confidence he has given to nigerians to make them believe that yes that he has something unique to give to them it's disappointing and unbelievable my people my people professor yakubo has really done the unbelievable and it's very disappointing yes i know what i'm talking about it is very very disappointing you, let's check the content, my people. You'll be shocked at this. This is morning news. Professor Chris Mwa Okobia, the spokesperson of the Obidati campaign organization, has accused the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, of the conducting the worst presidential election in the history of Nigeria. According to Arise TV interview, he criticized the lack of transparency from INEC chairman, Professor Mahmoud Yakubu, who is already on his way to the court to confess the real winner of the election. Despite the large amount of money spent by the federal government on the election, Omar Okobia cited the confession of the INEC chairman about glitches in the transmission of results after the February 25th election as evidence of poor management. He also noted that the presence of mutilated results, shit and cancelled original results which he claimed were unprecedented flaws the history of the country's election. However, he expressed his faith in the Supreme Court to address the issue and render a fair judgment. In his own words, there were mutilated papers everywhere. Original results were cancelled out and the RF portal was closed. We never had it this bad in our history. As a nation, every day Professor Mahmoud Yakubu wakes up his conscience. We give him a slap. <laughs> No be small slap you go give him. You go still give him better knock. Hmm? Um you see I I I don't believe that this will happen also in the history of Nigeria. Do you know the level and the position that Nigeria belong in Africa? Many people are not that doesn't know. If we know, we'll be disappointed with Nigeria that they could present something of this of this caliber as 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 a result. It's disappointing. Very, very disappointing. The world are watching us. Something that the whole world are watching us. Something that uh, the people group organizations are watching taking note of see how we made no sense of it see how we messed it up see how we mixed it up it's quite disappointing very very you won't believe that hmm. my people just because of the desperation of one man we sold our conscience away. We sold our reputations and respect away. It is crazy. Thank you for this very information. It's indeed 
over women. Thank you so much. Let's quickly get your opinion on these facts. Let's know what you think, what your own opinion, and what your advice on this may be. Don't forget to leave them below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.